Okay, so today, I'm very excited. We are opening 13 Ikoria 15 card collector boosters. So, some background. A um, couple of factors, including things going pretty fine. Um, I decided to get back into collecting magic cards and finding out that the Ikoria Lair of Behemoths set has Godzilla variants of cards uh, pretty much sealed the deal of me wanting to get back into collecting magic cards and opening packs because I grew up watching the Godzilla movies with my dad. So I'm very excited to go through these. Um, so I have 13 packs, which is one more pack than a collector's booster would typically have. But I am very excited to get through these. So let's get started. Might have been a better idea to do this beforehand, but it's too late now. And also for those that don't know, um, each of these collector's booster booster packs, so 15 card contains, 15 card packs have one card with an alternate art portraying Godzilla or a different Toho monster at least six special alternative frame cards, three to six rares or mythics, and at least nine premium foils. So basically, you're paying a little extra to get some more, some rarer cards, which that's collecting if I've ever heard it, or if I've ever seen it. Also, I've done a bit of research, so I know what to look out for. Obviously, the Godzilla variants will be fairly obvi obvious to me, at least. But what I'm hoping for is the King Ghidorah, which I believe is the rarest. It's definitely worth the most. Um, the Gigan card looks very cool as well. And also, the... Space Godzilla card looks well, or it looks great as well. So I'm looking for, hoping for Mothra also is in there. So Mothra, Gigan, King Ghidorah, Space Godzilla. Um, there are obviously others, but those are the cards that to me, I'm looking forward to the most. All right, so everything's open. So again, that's four. 8, 12, plus 1 is 13. So let's get started. Right away, Dinosaur. Snare Tactician. Okay. Premier Sergeant. Essence Symbiote. Drenith Healer. Lord Dracus. Ominous Seas. Foil Island. Ooh, Halden Avid Arcanist. It's a legendary creature. Partner with Paco Arcane Retriever. I think I have that. No, I don't have that. What am I saying? I haven't opened any Ikoria cards yet. Ooh. The <laughs> Karuga the Macro Sage. Interesting. Titan's Nest. Ooh, the alternate Boneyard Lurker. So I don't know all of the prices on the cards, but I do kind of have an idea of what to look out for. Cavern Whisperer. 
Vivian Monsters Advocate. All right, and then I believe the last card is always... And Space Godzilla, all right. That looks... Oh, Death Corona, okay. I think there's actually two Space Godzilla cards. But I got a Space Godzilla. Look at that. Looks awesome. Ooh, and then an Asp Auspicious Starix. And I'm actually going to... At least the Godzilla cards. As I said, I, I kind of have an idea of what I'm looking out for, but personally, I'm the most interested in the Godzilla cards. And since these are all going to be variants and foils, it might be tedious to try and sleeve everything. Ooh, cat. Okay. Unlikely aid. Wow. Yeah, that almost looks that looks a little more like um, this person's in danger than they're being helped, but Honey Mammoth, wow, look at that. Look at how sticky that honey looks. Swift water cliffs. Wingfold Terran. Pateran, Zenith Flare, ooh, Momentum Rumbler, ooh, another Foil Island, Nesting Grounds, Emergent Ultimatum, that looks, wow, those are massive, you can see there, I assume those are, those are human, humans, that looks awesome. Shark Typhoon. That I know is the most one of the most valuable cards right now. Granted, the, the set's been out for a while, but I think this is definitely one of the more expensive cards in the Ikoria set. So that's awesome. Porky Parrot. Yo, he's jacked. So it's a parrot porcupine who is jacked, okay. Vulpakeet. Dirge Bat. That almost looks like the bats. And wow, I forgot what they're called. And I could be wrong. Angurus, Armored Killer. All right. Ooh, and then a foil variant art parcel beast. Angurus. All Right. So we've got a Space Godzilla and an Angurus. And another cat token. Ooh, a Lava Serpent. That looks awesome. Blossoming Sands. Durable Coil Bug. Mysterious Egg. Neutralize. Counter Target Spell. Love Counter Spells. Barrier Breach. Wow, look at that. That is sick. I don't know if it's picking that up, but I like how the monster isn't foiled, but the surrounding area is for the, the barrier. So because these shards are in front of the monster, it's pretty three-dimensional looking. That looks incredible. Foil Mountain, Cartographer's Hawk. Ooh, Hunted Nightmare. Yadaro, Wandering Monster. If I remember correctly, that looks awesome too. 
I believe the Godzilla card is a variant of Yadaro, Wandering Monster. Could be mistaken. We might find out soon. Pouncing Shore Shark. Does it have legs? Looks like it has legs. That's terrifying. A shark with legs. Whoa. That looks awesome too. Snapdax, Apex of the Hunt. But prior to that was Lore Dracus. These beasts look incredible. I'm very excited. Zapdax, Apex of the Hunt. Wow. Double Strike. Oh, and then Dorat, the perfect pet. Sprite Dragon. Now, I actually don't know who Dorat is, but I am aware that this is the variant. Vulp and then another Vulpakeet. I assume is... A fox or a vulp. I'm not familiar with the word, but mixed with a parakeet. Oh yeah, shark token. A foil shark to match that foiled shark typhoon. I already forgot the name of the card. Shark tornado? Now it's gonna bother me. Uh, shark Typhoon, all right, Shark Typhoon. Another Honey Mammoth, another Swiftwater Cliffs, another Wingfold Terran, Aegis Turtle. Sanctuary Smasher. These beasts look fantastic. Trumpeting Gnar. Kudos to the artists. Ooh, Foil Swamp. Fireflux Squad. He's wearing a, he's wearing a suit. Cogla the Titan Ape. Zagoth Triome, Dreamtail Heron, another Porky Parrot. I feel like he's shouting, right? He's got he's got some spittle coming out. I feel like that only happens when you're shouting. Savai Triome, King Caesar, Ancient Guardian. Variant of Huntsman Liger. Look at that. And then a Migratory Greathorn. I think we're about halfway through. I'm not keeping track. We're actually not. We've got a couple more to go before we're halfway through. But we're getting plenty of cat tokens. Oh no, spoilers. Cloud Piercer. Ooh, it's got reach. Okay, so that's that's the end, but cat of one mind sleeper dart whisper squad humble naturalist sprite dragon that's what the perfect pet dorat was a variant of flying haste whenever you cast a non-creature spell put a one okay we need a non-creature spell. Okay, I see. Raugrin, Raugrin Crystal. Is that what the great ape was hanging off of? Seems similar at least. Foil Plains. Deadly Rollick. Rollick. So, <laughs> so it's stepping on his cape, dropped his sword, and this thing looks pretty happy about the mischief it's causing. Ooh, Dranith Magistrate. 
Endothotriome, Plain Swamp Forest, okay. Cavern Whisperer, another, I think that's a second variant of Cavern Whisperer, Glowstone Recluse, that looks terrifying. If I saw that, I'm definitely running the opposite direction. Raugren Triome variant, and Godzilla Primeval Champion. So this is not the Godzilla variant I was referring to for the other, for the turtle. I actually wasn't, I'm not fully aware of all of the, all of the variants, just the ones that I thought looked the coolest and are worth the most. But this, so nine mana, 11-11 Trample Cycling. Whenever you cast Titan Athrax, put a trample counter on target creature you control. Uh, so, classic big green creatures. Now we're about halfway through. Yes, we've got six and then the one extra. So after this, we're halfway through. Ooh, Feather. Token Artifact. Oh, I spoiled it again. Vulpakeet. Feather. Aegis Turtle. Ooh, Savai Sabretooth. Patagia. Patagia? Patagia Tiger? Bristling Boar? Real Scare Mentor. Ooh, Call of the Death Dweller. That looks awesome. Turn up to two target creature cards with total converted mana cost three or less from your graveyard to the battlefield. Put a Death Touch counter on either of them. Then put a Menace counter on either, on either of them. Okay, interesting. Another Foil Land. Foil Island Land. Selective Adaptation. Okay. Wow, that looks awesome. So in the three different pillars, you can see different adaptations for this panther, I assume, is being shown. That looks sick. That's awesome. Mythos of Snapdax. Wow, so it's like cave painting. That's pretty cool. Ketria Triome. I think that's another Boneyard Lurker variant. Majestic Oricorn. Looks like it's got horns coming out of the back of its head as well. Oh, that looks pretty. Indatha Trium. Ooh, and then a foil King Caesar. So that's two King Caesars, but one is foil. Awesome. Okay, now we're officially halfway through. Ooh, a cat bird. Flying token, no spoilers. Cat bird. Almighty brush wag, look at that. Man, that, he looks like, <laughs> he looks like someone said he was soft, and now he showed up ready to, ready to put some hurt in. Day Squad Marshal. Keep safe. Counter target spell that targets a permanent you control and draw a card. Love to see it. Ooh, Wilt. Is that an axe? Is this a plant? It looks like it's half plant, half weapons. Hmm. Jubilant Skybonder. Swallow Hole. Another Foil Swamp. Awesome. Fierce Guardianship. That looks awesome. Certainly fierce. Genesis Ultimatum. Wow. Is this the Sunwell? Not the Sunwell. Moonwell? 
one of the wells. More wa more Warcraft references. Quartzwood Crasher. Tr Trumpeting Gnar. That's kind of gross looking, actually. Migratory Greathorn. Ooh, Cub Warden. Now that's a fierce cat. Ooh, and then a Foil Space Godzilla Death Corona. So two Space Godzilla Death Coronas. One Foil, one regular, and then a Necropanther. Cat Nightmare. I haven't been paying too much attention, but it seems like there's lots of cats in this set. Cat bird. Okay. Beast token. Oh, there's a human soldier on the back of it. Have all of these tokens had things on the back? Hold up. Cat, so cat bird. Ooh. And then human soldier. Okay, so that's, I have a human soldier on the back. So if this third token also has a human soldier, I think I've figured the pattern. Oh, that's a feather, but human soldier. Okay. So it seems like the tokens, instead of having an ad on the back, all have a human soldier as well. <laughs> okay. So beast. Human soldier. Dreamtail heron. Sudden spinnerets. Shredded sails. And that looks like one of the airships that was behind the great ape card. Ooh. Excuse me. I'll have to look at that later. Boot nipper. Oh, it's got, it's got a mouth and then a tongue with a mouth. Boneyard lurker. Okay, so that's what it normally looks like. Still terrifying. Lead the stampede. Another foil island. Looks like I'm going to have a very shiny blue deck if I decide to make one. Man escape refractor. Yadaro, wandering monster. Trample haste. He has haste? When you cycle from your graveyard, you cycled a card named Yadara Wandering Monster four or more times this game, put it into the battlefield from your graveyard instead? Hold on. So you can just keep keep throwing out Yadara Wandering Monsters. That's 8-8 eight, eight tramples with haste. That's pretty great. Ooh, a foil Draneth Magistrate. I think the other one was a non-foil Drowneth Magistrate, Cavern Whisperer, another Glowstone Recluse. Whoa, whoa, Brakos, Apex of Forever. So this is a mythic rare, full art variant. I think this is one of the valuable cards as well. That looks crazy. So mutate, trample, you may cast Brakos, Apex of Forever from your graveyard using its mutate ability. And its mutate ability is three. So it's the same mana cost. So you can just cast him. Ooh, and a foil Angurus armored killer. And a, ooh, and a foil dirge pad. So I think with the exception of one whose name is forgetting or is, is escaping me again. The one that's the, the pet, I think so far that's a regular and foil of all the ones we've pulled. Oh, and, and Godzilla Primeval Champion. So King Caesar, 
Foil King Caesar, Godzilla Primeval Champion is the other one. Dorat is the one I was thinking of. So Dorat, Godzilla Primeval Champion. And all the rest we've pulled a regular and a foil of. So Angurus Armored Killer, Space Godzilla, Angurus Armored Killer. And King Caesar, Ancient Guardian. Okay, five left. Hopefully, no more duplicates, but if I get them, so be it. That's, that's the risk you take when opening packs. That's what makes it exciting. So, Beast, Human Soldier, Ooh, another Brush Wag, Day Squad Marshal, Keep Safe, Wilt, Ooh, another Sanctuary Smasher. Ooh, Splendor Mare. Haven't seen this one. Or haven't gotten one of these yet. Foil Mountain. Martial Impetus. Little, little Lightning Lance. Voracious, Voracious Great Shark. That looks terrifying. So, there, so there's a person. There's a boat that has been destroyed, so this thing is massive. Wow, that's awesome. Ooh, Lutri, the Spell Chaser. Is that an otter? It is an otter. Companion, each... Oh, so this is... That's right, there's beasts. The behemoths or the beasts or whatever in this set, I believe, have companion. Maybe it's not just this set. But Companion, where if you meet the condition, you can cast it once per game to... Actually, I don't think they're always bring them to your hand. This one looks like it's... If you've chosen Companion, you may cast it once from outside the game. Not sure what that means, but that's, that's interesting. That's awesome. Ooh, another Cloud Piercer. Necropanther. Whoa, Luca, Copper Coat Outcast. Legendary Planeswalker variants. And oh, baby Godzilla. Ruin <laughs> Ruin Reborn. It's a frog. And it is of a Polywog symbiote variant. Ooh, and then a foil cavern whisperer. So that's a new one. It's what we what we want to see. I'm pretty confident there's another Space Godzilla and another regular Godzilla. So it's a different art. It's a different card. So it's a variant of a different card. And they have a different name. So Cats, Human Soldier, Cathartic Reunion, add an additional as an additional cost to the spell, discard two cards. So discard two, draw three for two. It's pretty good. Ooh, Dark Bargain. Looks, looks pretty suspicious. Adaptive Shimmerer. Evolving Wilds. Insatiable Hemophage. That looks like a nightmare to me, that's for sure. Clash of Titans. Target creatures fight another target creature. Equal each deals damage. Yeah, that's 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 what fighting definitely means. Foil planes. Ooh, agitator ant. You never want to see a massive ant that's radiating an aura. It's probably not good. The beginning of your end step, each player may put two plus one plus one counters on a creature they control. Goad each creature that had counters put on it this way. Until your next turn, those creatures attack each combat if able, and attack a player other than you if able. Huh. Interesting. Mythos of Brokos. Yumori, the Collector. I am not sure what I'm looking at here. 
So it is the ooze. I don't know if that's a coincidence or if that's actually his face. Or its face. Spells you cast of the chosen type cost one less to cast. Interesting. Choose a card type, yeah. Ooh, Chittering Harvester. That looks like... I forgot what they're called in Skyrim. The big bugs. Another Cloud Piercer in Dotha Triome. Another Space Godzilla Death Corona. Void Beckoner. I don't think I've read this card yet. When you cycle Void Beckoner, put a Death Touch counter on target creature you control. All right. Ooh, Regal Leosar. Foil. So that is a third Space Godzilla Death Corona. So if I want to play a, play a black deck with Void Beckoner, they're all Space Godzillas. Okay, human soldier. Oh, it's the pack. Okay. Cat. Human soldier. Ooh, I don't think I've seen that one yet. Everquill Phoenix. Dismal Backwater. Gloom pang Pangolin. Pangolin. It's a Nightmare Pangolin. Ooh, Blade Banish. That looks sick. Wow. Holy crap. That looks awesome. Exile target creature with power 4 or greater. That looks really sick. Essence Shatter. Oh man, that looks cool too. Counter target creature spell. So it's specifically a creature counter spell. Whoa, void. Oh hey, that's what the regular Void Beckoner looks like. That looks terrifying. So, definitely think I prefer Space Godzilla to this. Reconnaissance Mission. Ooh, I think that's the first forest we've seen. Souvenir Snatcher. So if these are swords, helmets, this is a massive bird. It's a turtle bird. It's got a little, it's got a little carapace on its back and a tail. Song of Creation. Wow, that looks beautiful. You may play an additional land on each of your turns. Whenever you cast a spell, draw two cards. At the beginning of your end step, discard your hand. I see. So there's there's the trade-off. Skycat Sovereign. Another Cloud Piercer. Ooh, a Huntsman Liger. I believe that's what the... What was it? King Caesar? I believe that's what King Caesar is a variant of. Yep, Hunt's Master Liger. The Everquill Phoenix. So in this pack, I got a foil Everquill Phoenix and a normal Everquill. Normal. Pretty sure this is an art variant. Everquill Phoenix. And then a foil Godzilla Primeval Champion. All right. We've got two packs left. Let's see what we get. A cat bird and human soldier. Oh, there's what the actual cloud piercer looks like. Not actual, but I don't know what this would be. Normal art, but foil. You know, I think I actually like how this looks more.
They're not too different. This one feels more dynamic. So awesome. Ooh, a lurking dead eye. Destroy target creature that was dealt damage this turn, and it's a flash. Okay. Go for blood. So I can't tell if he is commanding this to charge or if he's fighting for his life and this is coming from behind him. Easily could go both ways. It doesn't look like it's looking at him necessarily. But cathartic reunion. Sanctuary lockdown. Humans you control get plus one plus one. Those, those crafty humans. Keen sight mentor. Is that a giant lemur? Ooh, another forest. Deflecting swat. It's deflecting a lightning bolt, which seems a little suspicious, but we'll let it slide. If you control a commander, you may cast this spell without paying its mana cost. Choose new targets for target spell or ability. Wow. Slither Wisp. Whenever you cast another spell that has flash, you draw a card and each opponent loses one life. Hunted Nightmare. Glowstone Recluse. Cavern Whisperer. And Cub Warden. And then... Another Angurus Armored Killer. Dreamtail Hand. All right. Last one. Ooh, a dinosaur beast. <laughs> a dinosaur beast token. It's a dinosaur and a beast. Mutual destruction. Oh, wow. So whatever beast this is, this is not the first, the first person it's, it's consumed. Spell has flash as long as you control a permanent with flash. As an additional cost to cast the spell, sacrifice a creature. One mana, destroy creature. Lava Serpent. Blossoming Sands. Ooh, a durable Coil Bug. Migration Path. Well, there's what the Majestic Oricorn normally looks like, so seeing this, I think I prefer the variant art. Another Foil Island. Yannick, Scavenging Sentinel. Mythic Rare Hyena Beast. Partner with Nikara Lair Scavenger. Okay, Mythos of Snapdex. The Ozolith. Ozolith. It's a lith. Trumpeting Gnar? That, that looks like he just, he's about to throw up. I'm sure he's trumpeting. And I think he's in some water or something, but it definitely looks like he's just throwing up. Another migratory great horn. Sea Dasher Octopus. That looks pretty cool. Oh, and then another baby Godzilla. Ooh, and a foil glowstone recluse. So not a foil baby Godzilla, but baby Godzilla. So that means the variants we got. Angurus Armored Killer, Foil Godzilla Primeval Champion, Death Corona, another baby Godzilla, Dorats, another Primeval Champion, King Caesar, Foil King Caesar, and then Space Godzilla, Foil, Space Godzilla, Angurus, and Angurus. Look at that, they, they all they fit perfectly here. All right, awesome. Glad I got Space Godzilla. Although, three's a little much, but 
overall, pretty excited. And so that's all for this one. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next one.